everyone. This Let's Play is going to be based on the game Paper Mario, which I'm sure a lot of you people out there are familiar with. They have a little intro here to introduce the storyline. I'll read. Today, I'm going to tell you the story of Star Spirits and Good Wishes. Far, far away, beyond the sky, way above the clouds. It's been said that there's a haven where the stars live. In the sanctuary of Star Haven, there rests a fabled treasure called the Star Rod, which has the power to grant all wishes. Using this wondrous Star Rod, the seven revered star spirits watched over our peaceful world. Carefully. Very carefully. And then... Oh dear, what the? Who stuck that weird thing into this story? Ha ha ha, yeah, I did. Gua ha 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 So I can at long last beat my arch enemy, Mario. I'll take the star rod. Do it, Kame Koopa. As she warps Bowser into Star Haven. And all of the stars are mayhem. No, you mustn't do that. <gasps> yeah, now let's try using it. Stop it! Cut it out, Bowser! As all the stars are going into star cards. Oh my god. Gwahahaha! <laughs> we did it! That was a piece of cake! Gwahaha! <laughs> As Bowser now has his own personal star card collection. Now star kids may rise to the haven to deliver people's wishes, but those wishes will not come true. Whatever can they do? So yeah, that's a little introduction to the game. Yeah, this is... I've pre-played. So we're gonna delete that. And we're gonna start a new file. Just to see if it works on the emulator. Had to change a few plugins and stuff like that. Anyway, if I can smell my name here, where? Wow, it's over there. Okay. A little problem I had with the interesting beginning scene there is how, uh, you know, the fire broke the barrier on the star rod. Like, that's bull. It should be way stronger than that. And of course, we start out at Mario's house. And the mailman, who we will see later on, Drop some mail. Mail call. And Luigi comes out and grabs some mail. Luigi is not a playable character in this game, unfortunately. That would have been awesome. Hey, Mario, we got a letter from a Princess Peach. And there's Mario. I'll read it to you, okay? Alright, uh, let's see. I'm throwing a party at my castle today. Mario and Luigi, I would be honored if you both could attend. Many guests from distant towns are hoping to meet you. There will be tasty sweets and all kinds of entertainment. I hope to see you here soon. Sincerely, Peach. As Luigi finished reading the letter, and now they're off to the party. Both Mario and Luigi. It's kind of funny how Mario and Luigi kind of live out in the middle of nowhere. And they just conveniently have a pipe that goes right into the beginning of Toe Town. And this is Toe Town. There's an item shop, some toads, the dojo, Merlin's house, the post office, some big star door, and there's Peach's castle. Right there. As we enter. What a magnificent castle. I never get used to this place. It looks like a lot of guests are already here. And we get control of Mario. Let's talk to some people. Princess Peach is such a generous one. Blah, blah, blah. Words coming to visit. Shiver region, I'll promise I'll pay you a visit. Do I know Frosty? No, I don't. Yes, Shiver region. It's cool how, like, all the toads have pretty funny names that kind of relate to what they do. And this is Tasty, <laughs> and she's the cook. Oh, Nintendo, and they're in funny stuff. 
and this is the apprentice to taste tea. But yeah, those, this door on the side here doesn't work. And also the door on the other side doesn't work either. They're locked. Ooh, a penguin! This castle's absolutely breathtaking! Well, you shouldn't. And you can't, so too bad. And who's this guy? He's the minister of Princess Peach's castle. He kind of looks like the counselor from Super Mario RPG. They just give him different names. This guy comes from Dry Dry Outpost. Probably see a desert place. I'll be sure to visit you too. And I don't want to talk to a mouse because that's just weird. Ooh, let's talk to you, Koopa. Come from Koopa Village just down the street. She is wonderful. I should know. Ooh, Shiver City. I'm guessing she's up in Shiver Region. And he has to go shopping with Frosty. Hey. How you do? Alright. Continuing on. Just showing this door's locked. None of the doors here on this floor open up. And we're going to continue on to the third floor. Here we are. Obviously guests are restricted from this area. Only Mario and other people can access it. Where are you, Princess Peach? Where are you? There she is. Oh, Mario, you came to the party to see me. You're so sweet. Thank you. Oh, yeah. I was just resting a bit. It gets tiring greeting all those guests out there. Nobody will bother us here. Shall we relax and chat, just the two of us? Oh, yeah. It was a lovely day today, so I'm sure it's comfortable out on the balcony right now. Would you come to me, Mario? Oh, yeah. Huh? What's happening? What is happening? Why well, heard the ground collapsing and the castle is flying? The hell? Bowser's castle? How did Bowser sneak that huge of a thing under Princess Peach's castle? Seriously. And let's panic by running back and forth and raising our hands. Where did Bowser get the technology to make a castle that flies? And able to implement it so he, it's under Peach's... What? That's some crazy stuff right there. Oh, are you alright, Mario? What in the world was that? I don't know. Beats me. Oh my, look, Mario. It's still daytime, isn't it? But well, I can see stars outside. As Bowser makes a nice entrance through the window. Gwahahahahaha! Long time no see, Princess Peach! Bowser! But this can't be! It was you who made the ground shake just now, wasn't it? Whatever did you do? Gwahahaha! Yeah, that was me. I've lifted your castle up into the sky. It's sitting on my castle right now. We're expecting that, huh? Ah, oh, this castle's under my control now, my dear. Now you will obey me. Not if I have anything to do about it. It's Mario! What a shock! Not really, I expected you to turn up right on cue. You're just as annoying as ever. Unfortunately for you, there's nothing you can do this time. Haven't you learned your lesson by now, Bowser? You can never defeat Mario. Why don't you give up already? Yeah, you tell him. Oh, what's different this time? You're gonna win this time. Huh. Mario, you can do it! All night long. Yeah, I can do it. Because I'm Mario! Take that! Oh no. Ah! Ow. Well, take this! Ha ha! Uh oh. Ah! Taste the gum on the bottom of my shoes! Ha ha! I love being a thorn in your side. Pathetic? They're not pathetic. Hey, what's that? It's a star rod. My god. Uh oh. What's he doing? Oh god. It's like. He gets like infinite Starman powers. Not fair. Three damage! Crap. Well, take this! Ah, crud. I'm boned. Oh. 
Okay, I think I'm going to cut it here. As next episode, we're going to try and beat Bowser, who is invincible and has infinite amount of starmen. Which is not fair. See you next time. On Let's Play Super Paper Mario. Not Super Paper Mario. Super Paper Mario. Let's play Paper Mario. Thank you. Thanks for watching.